The digital anchor Rachel Ramsey joins us now from the NBC 4i Digital Center with a look at the stories making headlines this morning. Hey, Rachel. Hey, good morning, Matthew. Top trending online right now. Ohio politicians hope the state catches President Joe Biden's eye as the next home for the U.S. Space Command. As the Biden administration continues their search, elected officials at the local, state and federal levels want Ohio specifically for its Wright-Patterson Air Force Base to be the number one choice. But the Air Force appears to have different plans. In an email Tuesday afternoon, a department spokesperson said Ohio did not make the shortlist for Space Command's headquarters. The final decision is expected to be announced soon by Air Force Secretary Frank Kendall. Columbus City Schools will put two levies on the November ballot. Residents in the district will decide whether to approve the tax levies, one to fund operating costs, and another to establish a reserve for maintenance and upkeep of the district's buildings. An existing half mill levy funded the replacement of dozens of outdated HVAC systems, but school officials say it doesn't go far enough. The district seeks a three mill levy for current operating expenses and a 4.7 mill permanent improvement levy for capital improvements. Also trending, ComFest, a volunteer-organized festival celebrating community and activism, is returning to Goodale Park this weekend. The festival is set to draw thousands to downtown Columbus on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Now, this year's lineup features live music, food vendors, educational workshops, and more. The event kicks off on Friday at noon. And for more information on those performances and the road closures for the festival, just go to our website, NBC4i.com. Matthew. Yeah, busy week, uh, or busy month, rather, Goodale Park. We had the Pride Festival last week, uh, ComFest this weekend. Yeah. And ComFest always fun. You never know quite what you're going to get when you show up there, but uh, mm -hmm. you get people from all walks of life. It's a great time. Yeah, I've never been to ComFest, but I definitely need to check it out. Yeah, got to make sure you get out there this weekend. All right, thanks so much, Rachel. And for the latest news, weather, and sports 24-7, make sure you visit NBC4i.com. You can also stay connected while you're on the go with our free NBC4 News app. Just download it today in the app or Google Play stores.